first couple announcements um, to start with. Uh, so one is that not this week, but next week, so two Thursdays from now, um, our next candidate, our last candidate is coming um, for our uh, ESRM faculty position. So I hope you guys can all make it on that Thursday. Uh, there's coffee at 10 if you guys want some free coffee and hang out and, and um, uh, talk with Dr. Cafella, and if you, it should, you can do a teaching demo at one that everybody's welcome to over at the Smith Decision Center. And then um, just above us, above this room at three o'clock, she'll be giving a research talk about um, uh, her work, her, her current work, and her future work. Um, on April 11th, we're going to be having our um, celebration of our service learning from uh, our uh, Maui and Mexico trips, uh, our most recent trips. So you should come on by, get some free food, and, and check out uh, uh, the work of your fellow classmates. Learn a little bit about Baja and or Maui. So those are, those are coming up. Um, and then another thing that just sort of got approved is um, I'm doing a research class this summer. So it's a class, you have to register, but there's, a, there's, a schol there's scholarships available to pay for uh, your registration fee. So it's like 500 bucks to register. It's a three unit upper division elective class. And we're going to be spending the summer doing work on um, plastics and things related to the deep sea and all that kind of stuff. And here's a little quick. So, so that's an opportunity open to everybody if anybody's interested. Um, and then the other thing I want to say before we get to our topic today is uh, uh, just a reminder. I know it's, it's the sort of middle part of the semester. Totally get it. People are getting burned. People are getting like, oh, I'm getting tired and all that kind of stuff. Um, but I just really want to encourage you guys in my class, but all your classes, keep up on your assignments. I, I know I get it. it it's uh, starting to be a drag at times. Um, you can always come see me for help. Again, I, it was weird mon uh, yesterday and the day before that I was in this 10-hour training all day long. They had to be on Zoom, so that was weird. So I didn't have office hours. I apologize on Monday or Tuesday, but, but that's all done. And so... Um, so happy to meet with you guys in office hours, or if those don't work and you guys are struggling, you guys can always reach out to me. We can, we can figure out a time we can get together. And, and do remember, we have Slack when you guys get stuck on something. Like, you know, and, and I don't have to answer. You guys can just ask the group, and people can respond. So do that. And then I just wanted to, I just looked at a little bit of data from, from you guys from this last week. Uh, I did it last week. Um, and this is basically folks that um, haven't submitted stuff. Either they, they, they didn't submit something, they submitted it late or whatever. And this is how, how uh, much you guys are watching the videos and stuff beforehand. And so it was a correlation, right? So obviously the people that, that um, are sort of late on assignments and stuff are generally speaking not, not watching the lectures and things as much um, beforehand. Um, but folks that do uh, watch the lectures ahead of time um, do better on our quizzes is one, is one metric, right? So um, one way to prep is just to make sure you guys view everything before class. And then that, that of course, correlates with uh, average grade in the class. So, so um, the more you guys can get all the, the readings done, the, the videos, and, and, and sort of run through the assignments, you're going to be better. And so, um, again, I understand that everybody's busy and things, things fall behind and stuff, but, but uh, make a concerted effort to not let yourself fall behind, and then you guys will be okay. Uh, 